Hi Aquarius, it's Elle here to do your September love reading. It's a love reading, it's general, it may not resonate with every Aquarius. If it does resonate with you, like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel, it's much appreciated. Sun, Moon, Rising, Aquarius, Venus, whatever you, you know, just come, watch. All right, so let's get, get into it. It looks like some of my Aquarius, you have a connection with someone, right? But there's so much, there's, for some of you, it's actual physical distance between the two of you. Or there's like emotional, mental distance. There needs to be some forgiveness that happens here. There needs to be a clearing of the air. Once you do that, there's like abundance that can happen for you. It's almost as if you know that your your abundance is wrapped up in someone or something else. You can't get to level B unless you complete level A, right? And you're completely running away from doing whatever completion process it takes to get to level B. Some of my Aquarius people, um, it's just not working. You want a divorce, you're hanging in there, you got one foot in, one foot out. There are children here. There's Some of you don't feel like you can like make it monetarily on your own. Some of you are dealing with illness or Some of you, okay. Some of you, somebody gave you an STD and it's something that, you know, you're dealing with and you feel like you just can't move away from this particular person and have anything real or abundant with anybody else. You know, it's almost as if, there's a tie and that's the tie it's like how do i undo that how do i move away from that situation pray for healing some of you are concerned about your health and well-being put more time effort into yourself understand that we age up we don't age down so don't forget about yourself don't forget about the time and effort that you need to put into self someone really loves you but it's just being pig-headed you're being stubborn you won't put that guard down and it's not as if you don't have reason but you got to find a reason to once again put the guard down again because this person, I think they finally get it. Whatever that is. All right. Okay, Aquarius, let's jump into the cards. So we're going to do for love, the past. The present and the future energy. Past, present, future energy for Aquarius. Let's go. What do you have to tell Aquarius more God? True, accurate messages for Aquarius. Thank you for speaking through. The Seven of Cups that just turned over. Whatever that means for you. being one one and done all right all right bottom of the deck the eight of wands nice so communication it's not face to face like i said some of you there could be distance actual physical distance between you and someone else there needs to be communication maybe about uh this could be loving communication or this could be about the trouble the drama in a relationship be with the fire sign, sun, moon, rising, Aries, 
Leo Sagittarius in the past. Wow, got the Ace of Pentacles. So there's some newness that's happened here. The start of something foundational, true, tangible, long lasting. It's about you grabbing it and taking it because you can have the Ace of Pentacles, the Ace of Cups, the Ace of whatever. It's, it's we still have free will. Presently, the Six of Wands, nice. All right, did somebody get engaged or somebody thinking about engagement? Maybe with a fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. Wow, and going forward, we have the Lovers and the Death card. Oh wow. So it looks like something is moving toward in the future energy. Somebody's going to make a decision in regards to maybe a soulmate, twin flame. I don't get into all that stuff type of situation here. Let's clarify. Um, could be dealing with a Gemini, but I really feel like this is like twin flame soulmate. Someone's going to put an end to indecision, to a choice between two parties. A Scorpio could be doing this. It will be complete transformation. It's moving fast. Some of you, okay, some, so some of you got something tangible. It could be a car, home, something that completely shifted the energy for you completely transform things for you and it's moving fast but it, it either has or is what is the ace of pentacle in the past what is the ace of pentacle in the past Lord? wow the ace of wands so something you get two new starts here in the past passion motivation was ignited reignited um it turned into something tangible did you take it did Aquarius take this? No, you were hesitating before making a decision. Still holding on to maybe the past or what happened in the past. Some of, for some of you, there's a large payout. Six of Wands in the present. What is the Six of Wands for, in the present for Aquarius? Six of Wands in the present for Aquarius. Five of Spades. My nose is itching. Do you know what that means? It means you're going to kiss a fool. I looked that up the other day. Anyway, completely off topic. Um, you are getting a lot of attention so you know there's somebody jealous this is jealousy be very cautious who you're around who helps you who says they're helping this is reversal okay these two yeah um cancellation here uh, you get an emotional offer be you get what you want this could be a legal contract could very well be marriage Aquarius whatever it is wow it, whatever it is it takes you to the king of diamonds or the king of diamonds is coming in and wanting to partner with you okay and then in the future you're gonna have a change of home a change of journey Somebody comes back and they tell you exactly what they want. They have made a decision. They know who they want, what they want. This is either you, Aquarius, or this is someone coming in for you. One more. So, yeah, they, they've made the decision. It wasn't without opposition. It wasn't without indecision also. They've chosen to lay down a burden. They may have some unexpected good luck here too. This is a home move, a job move. You have to choose something, Aquarius. Choose. 
this is like home yeah wow what's a wish fulfilled in the future for Aquarius you might have to lose a friend loss of friendship make a plan of action here okay let's get you some butterfly oracle cards let's close out whatever this is Aquarius it's like it's big it's what you've wished for it's a new start thank you Heavenly Father for letting Aquarius know what's coming for them where they are present what happened for them in the future in the past thank you Heavenly signs just flipped over for me so you might have some signs like you know Something comes to you, maybe in conversation and music. Heavenly signs again. Heavenly signs retirement. Seeking and finding sentimental feelings, finances. Some of you may have a like a job change, a career move. Do your research with the seven of swords here. Seeking and finding. Sentimental feelings are wrapped up in something. And some of you wanting to leave a situation. Let's see. Family changes, adult children. Family changes, home move. Uh, someone entering, exiting the home, adult children play a big part. This is the time of year where people are going back to school if you're in college and so forth. And just home changes here. Some of you, you'll be able to retire an old way of making money. Relationship dynamics at the bottom of the deck. Maybe you'll have a new way of making money to where you can put less hours, less energy exerted, still make the same amount of money or more. Um, it's just a retirement of something. You know, some of you could be getting a large payout because you have retired or, you know, could be anything. Finances are highlighted. Uh, it could be for the good, it could be for the bad. We do have the Four of Diamond and the Ace of Diamond or the Ace of Pentacles. So, could be for the good. Could be for the good. Ask your angels. Yeah. Seek and find. Ask your angels. Be assertive. Okay. trust nice it looks like the universe is really opening doors for Aquarius look for a sign heavenly signs Come on. perfect timing get more information we do have the seven of swords here okay it looks good for Aquarius. Um, there are like some foundational things happening for you. There's a change. There's a shift. Some of you feel like it's going to happen this way, but Spirit is like, mm, let go. Because we've got this mapped out, planned out for you. It's going to happen this way. And it's a part of you letting go, releasing, and allowing transformation to happen. Thank you for tuning in, guys. Remember to stay in prayer. I am praying for you. Pray for me as well. All of my information is below. If you need to request a personal reading, um, you can send me an email. You can go over to the website. You can um, go to Instago, but no, not really. Um, thank you once again. Make sure you're commenting below. Uh, yeah, Aquarius, really good energy. Take care, guys.